Hi there, this is Rob at Reason101.net and um, after my last tutorial on doing some live sampling and setting up your live sampler to um, to always be on the ready during your song creation process and to always sample whatever's coming into your or going out to your audio card uh, I had somebody ask me how to set that up in record so I'm here in record and I'm going to show you exactly how to set it up it's super easy um, right here you've got your master section and here you've got your sampling input so um, let's say you have a, a couple of instruments uh, you create let's see you create a maelstrom create a Thor I mean whatever you have going on here the easiest thing to do is underneath your master section just go in and create yourself a spider audio merger and splitter and it's the same process except you're using the master section um, going into the splitter and then you're taking one split going to the sampling input and you're taking the other split and going into the um, audio output so there you have it I mean anything that's going to be going into your master section now which is pretty much everything uh, will now go through to be sampled and will go to the outputs um, so that's pretty much how you set it up um, again, it's Rob at Reason101.net, and I hope that uh, that helps you get by doing your live sampling at uh, any part in the process. Just um, always have that spider audio splitter there, um, have it split, and you can even save this song as a template uh, so that every time you open it up, it opens up with that spider audio already there, so you don't have to keep setting it up every time. All right, so thanks a lot, and uh, have a good one. This is Rob at Reason101.net. Thank you.